Friends, Louie here on a Friday night. Yeah, we made it, huh? Wow, what a week it has been. Uh, for me, I've been looking at houses nonstop and uh, been really busy with trying to find a new place to live. But in the meantime, this package came in from Provident Machine Bearings. So uh, I think I know what it is, but I'm not positive. Let's go ahead and open this up. Oh, I guess I got a couple of things. With Provident, you always have to be sure to empty the box completely. They have been known to stack rounds in that paper. <clears throat> okay, so that looks good. And there we got a thank you from the People's Bullion Dealer. Well, Joseph, if you're the People's Bullion Dealer, why don't you stock the People's Poured Silver anymore? And why are you selling um, Amazon Rainforest uh, destroying silver companies like Hella Metal. But let's go ahead and check out what we got in here. I'm gonna open up um, the little one first. Bear with me. So how's your week been? Are you making it through okay? Weather turning nice again? That's good, right? Kids gonna be out of school pretty soon? Going to be off on summer vacation, getting a suntan, all that good stuff. All right. Okay, here we go. Man, this is taking a while. So what we have here is, oh, it's my tiger. Oh, wow, that is really nice. Gosh, I'm going to take that out of the plastic. Uh, this is the, uh, the South Korean mint. Um, new Lunar Series, first release in the Lunar Series for um, South Korea. Not to be confused with the Chiwoos, this is the 2018 Korean Tiger. And they have a long history of depicting this um, ferocious animal in very beautiful ways. Um, so there we go, there is their first release. God, that is a gorgeous proof like coin. And here is the back, which uh, some have said they don't like, or perhaps they don't understand. So please do post those of you that uh, read uh, this language and can interpret this. I don't recall um, what uh, the, uh, the uh, inscriptions mean, but they do definitely have a meaning. And I think it's quite lovely, actually. And uh, this is... Uh, this is definitely a proof-like coin, but not a proof-like price. And uh, not too many of you are, are getting this, I don't think, but I think it's quite the bomb. Um, and, uh, oh, I see why uh, we're not buying too many of them. This was $26. So, uh, but at $26, um, it is very, very proof-like. And I'm getting kind of tired of BU coins, though, in the high 20s. Something is going on in the market. I think they're uh, they're moving our cheese. <laughs> uh, mintage on that tiger is quite low, as I recall. And let's move on to the next. Okay, this is it, actually. And now I do know what this is. But um, this uh, was purchased uh, for Slacker Stacker, who has been uh, who has just completed his four horsemen set, and he picked up the bar to complete the set. And uh, I had made a comment on his set that, um, here it is, there's the Four Horsemen, that uh, he was asking whether you should do, I'm going to call that the obverse, because that's the common theme in the uh, Four Coins, or you should do the reverse. Well, uh, somebody went all to the trouble to carve all that, and I think that should be displayed in the box in that fashion. However, it does kind of disappear. It all rides together. And I said uh, to him that I wanted to uh, get one of these and antique it and show you just how beautiful this etching actually is um, so you could appreciate it, right? So uh, I'm not gonna do that tonight. This is just a quick Friday night unboxing. Um, but uh, next time you see this bar, it will be antiqued and you can uh, compare it to uh, the, the plain version. Yeah, definitely, definitely. A lot going on there with the Four Horsemen, but you just can't quite see it, can you? 
Okay, that's it for tonight. Have a wonderful Friday night. You guys be safe and sound, and we'll catch you on the flip-flop. Louie out. Uh, hey guys, I almost forgot that um, I have had a package from the silver bean counter for a while now, and uh, I actually made a video and lost it, so this is gonna be quick. Uh, hi Louie, thanks for the trade. I'm glad you, uh, you, did, uh, you got me a guitar pick for my stack, and you got a cool bean, and that was a straight up trade, which I'm happy to have done with the one and only silver bean counter. And let's go ahead and see what a silver bean looks like, huh? These are actually bigger, came in a flip. This is the Incus bean. These are actually bigger than I thought they would be. I don't know. I guess when you think of a bean, you think of something small. But um, here is the bean counter silver bean. It is made uh, custom order through MK Bars. All right, one ounce. And there is the Cool Bean in Cuse. Very nice. Thank you, Silver Bean Counter. Y'all get over there to his channel. He's got a fantastic channel. I do hope you'll check it out with good content. So thank you for the trade. I appreciate it. Sorry it took me so long to get this video up. All right, you guys. Bye now. Thank you.